Central Coast Living provides delicious opportunities for food. And this weekend, a tradition now entering its fifth year, means more tamale styles than you could dream up. We've been around for 25 years. Over at Garcia's restaurant in Atascadero. So, it's, it is an all family business, you know? Look, that's how you make it. It's almost a wrap on prep for the upcoming fifth annual tamale festival. We have my mom making tamales, my wife, you know, everybody's just making a lot of tamales. This year plans to be the biggest yet, extending two days, both Friday and Saturday, with food and events filled with Mexican culture. Mexican food goes good with everything, you know. <laughs> and the city of Atascadero is going all out. Just check out this sizzle reel of what you can look forward to. So this was an opportunity for us to get folks, residents out of their homes to come down and enjoy our events. And then also for folks to come who are visiting in the area or county residents coming over just to see what Atascadero is doing. So we have a variety of tamales, vegan, vegetarian, um, you name it, we got it. For Carlos and his family, there's real pride to show off their recipes. It's just a flair in it, you know, the, everything is made with fresh stuff, you know. And it's brought home some hefty hardware. <laughs> How many? <laughs> oh, <you're pretty> <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> the weekend also highlights the strong Mexican culture found along the central coast and in Atascadero. The food it just brings people together, you know, and more Mexican food, you know, because you can have it anyway. You know, you have a taco and it makes you happy, you know. I mean, it's just the whole idea, you know, of the Mexican food. I love it. No. <laughs> Friday is Kids Night, a sneak peek on Friday with tamales too. Saturday will include fireworks. We have more information on our website, ksby.com. Let's go back.